Hi there, my name is Ashington DC and this is a tutorial on how to install a Steam skin to personalize your Steam client. In this video, I'll be showing you a website where you can download skins, I'll be showing you where to place the skin, and I'll be showing you how to pick and choose the skin and set it as your theme. This here is the default Steam skin. What I want you to do first is head over to the description of the video and hit the first link you see. It should take you to skinyoursteam.com, this website here. And here you'll find a bunch of skins that you can use with the client. And I like this website because it has a pretty good collection of skins. You can find skins in other places too, but, you know, I found this, looked good, so I'm using it. Go to most popular because... For this purpose of the video, should have some pretty good skins. Actually, I'll use this one, the one I was using before, Metro for Steam. Gonna hit download. Uh, yeah, let it save in the desktop. Open that up. This requires a font because it's a uh, Windows 8 font and I'm on Windows 7. So, gonna hit install. It's already been installed before. So, gonna do that anyway. Going to Metro again. And this is the folder we want. So go ahead and into computer, local disk, program files x86. Uh, if you're on a different OS, then do what you need to do to get to the Steam folder. Go to skins, and we are going to copy this folder into skins. Wait for that to finish. And done. All right, going to close those. And we'll restart Steam. Restarting it because it needs to uh, refresh the list and all that. So it'll identify the skin that we just put in there. So I'm going to go into Steam, Settings, Interface, and right here. Select the skin you wish Steam to use, require Steam to restart. Metro for Steam, hit OK. Let it restart. And as you can see here, the uh, load up thing changed. <laughs> and there we go, skinned. So yeah, that's basically the process. You can choose a different skin. You got to do the same thing. Uh, download it, get the folder. If there's anything else you need to install, install that first. Put it into the Steam Skins folder and restart. Select it. Easy. So yeah, that's it for this video. If it helped you out, uh, give it a thumbs up. So other people know as well. If you have any suggestions, tips, comments, questions, that sort of thing, put it in the comment section below as always. I uh, appreciate it if you checked out my other videos. I have a Minecraft series going on right now. And subscribe, of course. <laughs> That's it for this video. Thanks a lot for watching. And hopefully I'll see you again. I'm Ashington DC, signing off.